Welcome everyone. A good Nerv Shabbos and a good Erev Yom Adin. Wow. Erev Yom Adin. As it's the last Shabbos of the year, the last, excuse me, the last day of the year. And we learn, uh, we, lo we learn having in mind that Rabbi Nishalem, please give us a good year that we should be able to learn every day. This is what we want to be doing. This is this is this is what we want to be doing with our time. So uh, please give us the wherewithal that we should be able to do it, and uh, the health and no distractions that we should be able to concentrate on doing your will and learning Hashem's Torah. Um, we uh, we are learning in the beginning of Mesechtas Megillah, and we are uh, up to Mishnah Gimel, and the first parak, as we are dedicated uh, by the Fisher family, Lenishmas Basi Bas Robert, uh, Shlomo Ben Avram Alevi, Peril Bas Ruvain, and Neshama should have an Aliyah, and uh, we're sponsored Lila Nishmas Chaim Zanvil Ben Moshe, Lufu Shalem Yaliyo Moshe Ben Chai Yisrael, Lizchus Avram Ben Yom Benish Ben Malk Yudas and family. We learn Lufu Shalem for Vigdor Aryeh Ben Rivka, for Mayor Ben Chai Yisrael. We also are sponsored by Yoh Klugman and family, who in their kindness has sponsored the learning of the Mishnah Yaimis. And we, we hope that Hashem should grant them everything wonderful. Um, we uh, learn Ezel Yer Gedoyla, what constitutes a big city that they therefore don't go back to the Yom HaKnisa, to the uh, Monday and Thursday. Uh, they don't have that uh, allowance. Kol Sheyesh Ba'asor a city that hires 10 people to be available that there should always be minion. Pachas Mikan, if it doesn't have that wherewithal, Harizek Fav, that's a village, that they have the license that they could go back to the closest Monday uh, or Thursday when they would go in to the big cities for din and they could, that since they didn't have somebody to lane for them and they would have to make a second trip, they don't have to make a second trip. The Elo Amru, by Megillah we say Magdinam Veloy Ma'achrin that we go, go back, but we don't go ahead, because by the Megillah it says, Lo Yavar. Remember we said that the, the, the uh, there were families uh, that uh, when Ezra came up, they didn't have enough wood, so they dedicated wood, and they were given a special day uh, of a Yom Tev where they brought a carbon Aitzim and a carbon Ayla. If that fell out on the Shabbos, then they go to the next day. Also Tisha B'Av, uh, if Tisha B'Av falls out on Shabbos, we go to the next day, because Makdeminon Puranasa, Loi Makdeminon. Chagiga, when you have to bring the Shalmei Chagiga, if it falls out on Shabbos, then uh, you can't bring Nedavis on Shabbos, and then you bring the Shalmei Chagiga the next day. The Hakel, Hakel is the mitzvah to come and hear the Melech in the Sukkot after Shemitah, on the day after Yom Tev, so they gathered to hear the Melech, and you had to bring even the children. So if it fell out on Shabbos, so then they did it the next day, because you can't bring the children on Shabbos, uh, you can't carry the children. So in the, all these days, Ma'akram, you go ahead, Veloy Makdeminan, you don't do it earlier. Afal Pisha Amru Makdeminan Veloy Ma'akram, even though we say that we do it on the Monday before or the Thursday before, Mutorin Behespid Ubetanios, that day, when they hear the Megillah on the Yom HaKnisa, they're allowed to have eulogies, they're allowed to do Tanis, and Umatan Savyanim. They, they could do, even though it's not the day of Purim itself, but since they lay le in the Megillah, and the Eneim Shalaniim and Suvis Bemikra Megillah, they rely on Mikra Megillah to collect uh, a Matan Savyanim. You could give Matan Savyanim, even though it's off the day of Purim. You cannot do Shalach Manis, you cannot do uh, Suvis Purim. Amr Rabbi Yehuda, when do we give this allowance? When they come in the, the Monday before or the Thursday before to hear Kriya Satira or to go to the Din, to the Bezdin, which met on Mondays and Thursdays. 
אבל מקרים שאין נכנסים לא בשני ולא בחמישי, אבל אם הם לא נכנסים בשני ולא בחמישי, אז אין קורן עשרה בזמן, אז אפילו בבילגים הם נכנסים את זה על ה-14th of Adar. קורא את המגיל הבא הראשון, let's say at the time of the Kiddush HaKodesh in Bezden, if they lay in the Megillah, there was only one other. And then Bezden decided to intercalate the year and add a second other. V'nisabra Hashanah, Kareen HaSabah Dushenim. They lay in it again on other Shenim. Now, when they already intercalated the year before, so there's an other Aleph and an other Bez, אין בין עוד הראשון לעוד הראשון, there's no difference between עוד הראשון ועוד הראשון, that means that both the 14th uh, and the 15th of Adar, of the first Adar and the second Adar is Osir Behesped Betanis, you can't have eulogies, you can't have fasts, the only difference is Elikriyas and Megillah Matans of Yainim, that the laying of the Megillah and the giving of the gifts to the poor and the Sudas Purim and Mishlach Manis is done on the other Samar Chlonisen, which is the second order and not on the first order. This is the last Mishnah Yomis Shir of Tav Shin Pei Gimel. The next time we will reconvene on Matzah Yom Tov. It will be already be Tav Shin Pei Dalev. I want to take the opportunity to listen, to wish all my viewers and listeners a year that's coming up of Gezunt, Parnasa, Nachas, Menuchas HaNefesh, and everything wonderful, sweet Shalom Bayis, and 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 shiduchin and 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 children born that are healthy and happiness and no scares and uh, I hope that this year Tav Shem Pei Dalit is Shnas Daf Tei Shnas Daf so there should be a Mitz Hashem Daf Yomi in your life join us on Matzah Yom Tov when we will learn two blot the two blot of Yom Tov we already learned Friday's blot last night but uh, we'll learn the two blot of Yom Tov. At 9.30, and then Tzum Gedalia, this year is 9 o'clock, the rest of the week it's 8 o'clock, at zoomdaft.com. Have a good Shabbos, and a good Yom Adin.